Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to the Blackwell Deception. Okay, let's go ahead and head over to the coffee shop. Since we've uh, discovered that uh, Rachel Abu, apparently uh, the friend of Tiffany Walters, has uh, is running the cafe now. I s Hi, Durkin. Ignore us. We're just going to be talking to your barista here. Hi again. Hi! They don't really seem... I don't know. The, the picture didn't look that much like that portrait. Are you Rachel Abu? Yeah, that's me. Tiffany. I wanted to talk to you about Tiffany Walters. Tiffany? What about her? Well, I'd like you more, friends, some more right? information. Sort of. Yeah, we were friends before... Well, before she died. I'm looking into her death. Why? Wasn't it a brain aneurysm or something? That's what I'm trying to find out. Well, okay, but I'm not sure what kind of help I can be. Giving me background information would be good. Do you ever go up to the High Line? Sometimes. Why? Oh, no reason. Ah, uh, there is a reason. You know, just get to it in a moment. Do you know anything about a nightclub called Munray's? Nope, I don't think so. Sorry. And not that we need these, but you know anyone might as well ask about them because we can. Nope. Sorry. Have you ever heard of STP? Nope, I don't think so. Oh. Sorry. Hmm. So you and Tiffany were friends? A few years ago. We were both office temps, and when our jobs ended, we got close. I went on to start this place. She stayed on with the temp agency. She was trying to find her way, you know? Maybe she thought she found it. What do you mean? Oh, um, she met some guy named Ken at one of her temp jobs. Then she stopped hanging out with me. Same old story. I don't blame her. It happens. I don't know, that's kind of rude. Um, we'll ask about those two in a minute. Is there anything else you could tell me about Tiffany? I told you everything I know. Really. I think you know more. You wouldn't know anybody Might named know Gavin, you know would more, you? But... Funny. I think Tiffany did mention that name once or twice. Tell me more. But I don't remember the context. Sorry. Dang it. Rachel said that Tiffany went out with a man named Ken. She met him while working in an office temp job. Temp agency. According to Rachel, Tiffany met Ken while working on a temp assignment for a temp agency. She doesn't know which one. Do you know where Tiffany was temping when she met Ken? I wouldn't know. She never told me. And those temp agencies bounce you around. What about the agency she worked for? We didn't work at the same agency, so I wouldn't know. I'm sorry. You wouldn't know, or you just don't know? There's a difference. What do you know about the guy Tiffany was with? Only that his name was Ken, and she met him while on one of her office temp jobs. Tiffany was kind of intense about him. She really fell head over heels. I couldn't tell if it was sweet or if it was scary. Scary? Why would it be scary? Thanks. Right, well, I'll see you around. I think it's Have a good night. All I uh, can get, a, get out of you for now. Have you no other employees? That is not a very happening coffee shop, I must say. All right, back to Tiffany's. All right, Joey, do your thing. Stay close to the door, Red. I'm heading in. After you, Joey. Oh, Tiffany. Hello again. What? Let's consult our notes. Ken. So, tell me about Ken. Ken? Yes, He's Ken. Wonderful. Is he now? He's... I can't begin to explain. Tiffany's apparently barking now. He... Wait. Nope. Not you Go two. back to... Ah, damn it. Huh? Why is everyone against us? I don't understand. I don't even I'd know like anything about understand. it. How about you tell me about it? Just go away. No, can't do that. Temp agency. So, I heard you work as a temp. Yeah, I'm a temp. I know it's not a real career, but so what? Eh, if it pays the bills. I'll find my way. In fact, maybe I already have. Yeah. Easy there. I was just to asking. Death. No judgments here. So. Yeah, I'm a I know it's not Easy there. Dang it. Hmm. Well, see. Yeah. That's not helping me any. I don't think she... Not sure what... Not sure. It's the way out. All right, that didn't help me much. Okay, you can relax. I'm back. Joy. Yeah, <laughs> I love that. 
All right. Uh, phone. Uh, compare notes. Temp agency can. If there's a connection, I don't see it. No. Can STP. No connection that I can see. STP could be a temp agency, I suppose. Only one way to find out. Give me a sec. You talking Aha. to me? Bingo. STP stands for Sterling Temp Placement. Ah, and okay. here's the address. It's just south of Midtown. You enjoy that thing a little too much. What, just because it has Wikipedia on it? New location, Sterling Temp, Sterling temp Placements. No connection that I can see. Okay. Hmm. So, client, maybe it was uh, Ken. Do you have any new emails? No, we don't. How did she get the money to make those uh, business cards anyway? I guess she does have a book out. Even if it didn't sell well. That This looks like a horrible place to work. Hi, are you busy? Hmm? Sorry, we're not taking new applicants right now. And I... even if I were, it's several hours past closing time. Then I'm why not are you here? For a job. Sorry, I was hoping to ask you some questions. Will this take long? Yes. It depends on you. Fine, what do you want? It's totally going to be a, a very long You're time. You're open kind of late. Like I said, we're not open. Just because I'm not seeing a client doesn't mean there isn't work to do. Do you ever go up to the High Line? I don't. No time. Uh, Monterey's. Do you know anything about... No, I... No, I don't. Okay, Lane Appleton. Do you know anyone named Elaine Appleton? No, I... Okay. Do you know anyone named Ken? I think Tiffany was involved with him. I can't tell you anything about that. That's confidential information. Damn it. So something happened, but you can't tell me about it. I said nothing of the sort. Yeah, actually, you kind of did. Just saying. So, what can you tell me about this place? If you want to know more, come back during business hours. I don't want to. I'm I here wanted now. to talk to you about Tiffany Walters. She used to work for this agency. Yes, I remember her. I need to know what company you placed her in. That, I'm afraid, is confidential. Are you aware that Tiffany is dead? I am aware, yes, but it doesn't change anything. Damn it! You know anything about Gavin? Do you know Gavin? anyone named Gavin? No, I don't. Hmm. Well, thanks. I'll be going. Right. Or will I? Sterling here forgot to change the month. Oh, kind of like, uh, uh, Rosa. They look like leaflets advertising this office. Now there's a logo that's overcompensating for something. Just saying. I don't get it. Typical suit. Pale from sitting in an office all day. Probably has an ulcer, too. Uh, you're in a suit, too, you know. I suppose if we run out of paying gigs, she could use a place like this. Oh. We don't need to go back there. Y yes, we do. I don't think I need it. I don't need his... Looks like a race car calendar. That uh, sounds boring. They look like leaflets for this temp agency. His name is Sterling, I assume. He looks honest enough, although he's not very friendly. Definitely not friendly. This is STP, all right. Yep, he's still there. I don't think he'd like it if I wandered through his office. Can't imagine why not. <clears throat> all right. Go back to the cafe? No, not the cafe. That's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. Well, I suppose we could ask her about Sterling. Hi again. Hi! Hello! I'm not gonna buy coffee, I'm just here to talk. Have you ever heard of STP? Nope. That that's the same thing. I, I was expecting Sterling. Thanks. Okay. I'll have it. Hi, Darkin. Maybe like Dworkin. Dorkin. I think that's from an MST3K. Can't remember which episode now, though. Uh, let's go back to Tiffany. Oh, Tiffany! Stay close to the door. After you, Joe. Now will you say anything about Sterling? Hello again. What? Sterling. I heard you worked for Sterling. Well, those jerks. Yeah, those jerks. Jerks. 
They fired me, terminated my contract. For no, no reason. reason. How rude. Sorry to hear that. Whatever. It's not like there aren't other temp agencies. Well, that's true. Um. So. Nice. Ken? I'd like to talk to Ken. Why? So you can tell him more lies about me? No. I don't think so. Uh, that's slightly different than what we got before, but. I'd like to talk to Ken. You think you could introduce me? Why? I don't. Hmm. Well, see. Yeah. yeah. It doesn't say much. Um, I suppose maybe we could talk to. Uh, okay, you can relax. I'm back. Joy. I got something to. Yeah. What's with all the kids out there? They're just. All right, check with notes, Sterling. I guess Tiffany worked with the Sterling Temp Agency. Seems like it. Can. So Tiff's in love. That explains why her spook is sticking around. Love can do that. Love and death, Red. There are no rules for either of them. I'm pretty sure we can find some rules for him. Alright, let's get back to it. Sure. I'll write him up. Alright, maybe we do go talk to, uh, um, Durkin. Back to the cafe. Hi, Hi Durkin. Durkin. Yeah. Have you ever heard of a temp agency called Sterling? Please say yes. Sorry. Damn it. No one named Ken. Do you Ken. know anything about an affair between someone named Ken and Tiffany? What is this daytime soap opera? Yes. Out? Yes, it no, is. No, I don't. <laughs> I like that he had something different to say. Just the name Tiffany Walter. Nah. <sighs> well. See. Shouldn't you be back at work now? Really, shouldn't you be back at work now? Um, Highline? No. Lisa? Yes. Hi. Lisa? Oh, it's you. Have you learned anything? Lots of things? Ah, nothing. nothing con then why are I'll be I'll back. I'll be back. Okay, um, hmm. Back to Sterling, I suppose. We could try that. His name is Sterling, I assume. Hi again. Yes? I know you terminated Tiffany's contract. Could you tell me why? Look, we had a serious complaint and had to let her go. That's all I can say. You can't tell me who made the complaint. Absolutely not. Why not? Secrecy. Why the secrecy? Surely Tiffany won't mind. She's dead. Look, whatever happened, happened at the client's office. And I like to keep my clients. Agencies like mine are struggling to stay in business. People just aren't hiring temps like they used to. So if it's all the same, I'm keeping my mouth shut. It's so you say your reputation is important? Of course it's important. Without it, who would do business with us? Well, thanks. I'll be... Right. You might be interested in seeing this. Yeah! The City Post? Is that who you're working for? Yes. Yes. It's the biggest paper in the city. Maybe you can be more forthcoming. Yeah! No, it doesn't change a thing. Confidential is confidential. You just made doubly sure that I won't say anything. Damn it. I don't see how... I already told him I was a reporter, showing him this... Don't. Hmm. That might not be... I shouldn't be able to screw things up that badly in the in this game. Uh... Sterling. Sterling Temp Placements. Hmm. Ken. I'm 
going to have to be more specific than that. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. Um. Don't know what I can do with. We don't need to go back. Yes, we do. We need to figure out what he's working on. It's more information. What do you want me to do? Don't know what I stir. Typical. I could blow on him. Blow on him. I haven't done that. I ain't gonna wait. Hmm. Now well, maybe we go back to talk. Back and talk to Tiffany. All right, Tiffany. Stay close. After you. Hello again. We're back and forth than what? I expected here. Then again, it might just be... No. Hmm. Why do you think... I don't know. Oh. It's run by an emotionless sleaze bag. I never liked him. I was actually expecting about the same thing. Why do you think Sterling fired you? I don't know. It's run by an emotionless sleaze bag. I never liked him. About this Gavin fella. I told you I don't know. I think you know something. So you say. Tell me no, more. No, I can't. You can't say? Why are you bothering me? Hmm. Just leave me alone. I'd like to talk to Ken. You think you can- Why? So you can- I don't think- That's not helping me any. Well, see- you. Yeah. Late 20s. Can't go back there. Okay, you can relax. Joy. Let's have a little. What is it? I guess Tiffany. Seems like. Alright, that's. That's nothing new. So, Tiffany had a fella. I think we have our next lead. We have to find him first. Yep, we do. The pavement's outside, doll. Start pounding it. It's not exactly what I was looking for. All right, let's... Sure. Gotta say... What is it? I think I stepped in something disgusting on the street outside. <laughs> Wouldn't be surprised. I think the streets around here get cleaned about once a decade. If Tiffany worked for a temp agency, we need to find out which one. I already one. figured out which one. Finding stuff out is what we do best. That's all for- Yeah. Okay. Not helping me any there. Hmm. <laughs> Let's go home for a minute. Joey, I'd like to talk to you. What is it? Are going to get All anything right. different? Let nope. That's all. Yeah. Keep going to those other ones. Uh, Tiffany and Ken? Rachel told me that Tiffany was seeing a man named Ken. Yeah, that doesn't help me much. No, I don't... Tiffany used to work for a temp agency called Sterling Temp Placements. Lisa said that she referred Tiffany to Gavin. I don't think those are... Con no connection that... No connection that... Tiffany used... Terminated her contract for no reason, according to Tiffany. Maybe if I go back and talk to them again, since she's saying no reason. Hi again. Yes. I resort well, to blackmail. I'm afraid that I have no choice but to end my article with you. Huh? What do you mean? An investigation is like following links in a chain, and you're the last link. Is this supposed to be a threat? I've told you absolutely nothing. Oh, That's don't worry. I'll just write the truth. 
about how you fired her and then refused to comment on her tragic death in the City Post, read by millions. That should do wonders for your reputation, don't you think? Yeah. <laughs> Why are you harassing me? Surely there are other leads you could follow. Nope. Maybe, but I'm on a deadline. Ah, uh, deadline. It's deadlines. a shame that I don't have someone else to harass instead. Maybe then I could avoid mentioning this place entirely. Yeah? yeah. This is blackmail. So? What's your point? Fine. The man you want is Ken Sharp of Sharp Sound. Now just get out of here. Thank you. Okay. Let's go home real fast. So, we've got Ken Sharp. No, I don't... Alright, let's, uh, let's see. Ken Sharp. Sharp Sound, owned by Kenneth Sharp, Cecil... Oh, Cecil Sharp. This Ken must say. be pretty special for Tiffany to fall so hard. Could be. He might be the link we're looking for. Nah, you're not gonna say anything about that. All right. After you. That's all for now. Yeah. All right, sharp. That looks like the door we want. Eh? It's the door Stores? to the stairwell. Stairs? Stores? Whatever. The call button for the elevator. Note. Becca, found your phone. I've got it in my desk drawer. Swing by when you get a chance and I'll give it back to you. Ken. Becca. Hmm. It says, Gal Friday Publishing. Gal Friday I'm not Pub taking publishing. that. Can we use the stairs? I'm not walking down 33 flights of stairs. Oh, it's good for you. Same thing, okay. Why do so many people lose their phones? Jeez. Alright, that's not actually what I wanted. Whoops. My bad. <laughs> no, the picture was uh, kind of It says sharp blacked sound. Out there. That looks like I'm not taking Why not? Take it. Come on in. Hi, are you Ken Sharp? I sure am. What can I do for you, Miss... Blackwell. I'm not interrupting anything, am I? Nah, the midnight oil can wait. What's up? I'm helping out the City Post with an article. I was hoping I could ask you some questions. The newspaper. Sure. Ask away. You sound kind of familiar. So, what can you tell me about this place? This place? We're an audio studio. You need any voiceover, music, or sound design, then we're your guys. Oh, you don't say. You don't happen to, uh, uh, no Mike Center Nicholas, do you? No? I don't think Do you so. ever go up to the High Line? That just opened up, right? Haven't been able to get up there yet. Uh, do you know, do Elaine you know Appleton? anyone named Elaine Appleton? Hmm, can't say that I do, no. Do you know Munrays? Do you know anything about a nightclub called Munrays? <laughs> My nightclub days are long gone. I just help make the music now. Okay. Um... You tell me about Sterling. Do you ever deal with a temp agency called Sterling? Yeah, I use them to hire temps sometimes, when things get busy. Are you using them now? Not at the moment. Things are pretty slow. Okay, uh, what can you tell me about Tiffany I was Walters? hoping to talk to you about Tiffany. Tiffany? Walters? She used to work for you, as a temp. Did she? I'm afraid we've gone through quite a few times. Ah, he doesn't look yeah, too happy. Yeah, I bet he has. Oh, so, uh, I'm sorry. She might have worked for us, but I don't remember her. Hmm. So, tell me about yourself. Not much to say. What you see is what you get. You don't say. Are you sure you don't remember anyone named Tiffany? Positive. Sorry, I can't help you. Are you sure you don't- Positive. Do Gavin. you know anyone named Gavin? Hmm. Can't say that I do, no. Hmm. So, not much to Do you ever deal- Yeah. Are you using- Not a- Okay, let's see. Jog Are his memory. Are you sure you don't remember a Tiffany Walters? I told you, I don't remember anyone named Tiffany Walters. You seem a little angry about this here. 
Let's uh, ask about Tiffany and Sterling. From Sterling. He confirmed she worked here. Yeah, for all I know, he might be right. But I don't remember her. Like I said, we go through a lot of temps here. Right. The you complaint. filed a complaint with Sterling about Tiffany. You don't remember that? Have you ever worked with temps? Some are all right, but others? Well, there's a reason why they are temping. So sure, I've made my share of complaints, but can I remember any specific one? No. Are you sure you I told Hmm. Well, thanks. You're uh, not around. really uh, telling me what I want to know. All right, well, Joey, I'm going to go in and snoop around. You sit tight. Let's see what's back here. Nothing important back there. Damn it. There's nothing I could say to him other than his suit needs to be let out a few inches. <laughs> he looks pretty intent on, well, whatever the hell he's actually doing. See, can we look in the drawer? <sighs> I can barely make anything out in here. Black it's thing. Kind of black? I have no idea what it is. I can't see a thing. Paper. It looks like a letter. I can't make out what it says. I'm gonna have to get a uh Get one of the cards in there, aren't I? Uh, I think so. Equipment. I couldn't even begin to guess what this stuff is for. Ah, you can screw what it. What am I supposed to do? Them. Sing to it? Sure. I couldn't... Actually, let's go I'm back in, go in and snoop around. Band photo. Yeah, this looks familiar, doesn't it? Framed Polaroid. What if we got an uh, uh, achievement for that? Blowy Malone. Use Joey's breath power on at least ten people. <laughs> uh, let's see. Dumpster Diver. Find a lost item. Take my card. Use Rose's business card for an un unintended purpose. Music lover, find Jamie's favorite song. Still got it. Not bad for a dead guy. Alright, resume play. Um, hmm. Can we blow on you? Whoa. Feels like the AC kicked in. Yeah, it does. Whoa. Feels like the AC kicked in. Alright, that's not doing me much. All right, let's uh, let's go ahead and uh, leave then. I'm gonna have to get in there another way, I think, so or something like that. I can go in over here. Nothing interesting in there. Dang it! What about the stairs? Just a stairwell. Plant. If it plays a bit of color. I'll give it that. All right. Well, let's uh, see if Come I can on in. give him uh, my business card. Uh, oh, eh, the framed Polaroid. Who's that man in the photograph? Him? Uh, that's my dad. He and I started this place um, about 20 years ago. He's retired now, but he pops his head in sometimes. That's an interesting picture up there. I don't recognize the band. Well, you wouldn't. That was my dad's group. They haven't been together since the 60s. Yeah, kind of because, uh... They died. Well, yes. They died, I think. What? <laughs> he never talked about <laughs> it much. <laughs> I like that. Um... I got no, uh... No notes there. Were you ever in a relationship with... Miss Blackwell, was it? I have a wife. And two kids. And none of them are named Tiffany. I'm just following a lead. I was told that Tiffany was involved with someone named Ken. Well, it wasn't me. Do you have any other Kens working here? Are you sure you don't... I told you. 
No. Well, thanks. See you around. No, I, I've... Dang it. I kind of want to give him my uh, business card. Slip business card into that uh, drawer. Hmm. Well, um... I think for now, we'll uh, go ahead and save it and uh, we'll pick it up in the next episode. See you then.